Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, so I realized that I actually didn't film an intro for this video, um, so I just quickly want to let you guys know what's going on. This video is going to be one that you guys actually suggested. A while ago on my Instagram, I put one of those question features on my story asking you guys what I should film. And um, one of you suggested that I film how to put together a bomb ass outfit, so I'm not saying I'm the best candidate for this job, however I do think that I put together fairly decent outfits every day, so if you guys kind of want to allow me to take you through my head and just the process of picking out pieces and putting together an outfit, definitely keep on watching. Okay, so we're switching to my phone because it's easier to carry and the camera has really slow focus, so, okay. So, this is the closet, really nothing special, but this is the situation. Um, so I pretty much just have all my jeans um, and trousers along the side, trying to color coordinate, and then everything here is like my shirts my dresses and then the jackets that i reach for in um the most uh typically depending on like what season we're in then i have another closet for like my other jackets that i don't reach for the most and my winter coats and stuff like that then down here i pretty much have all my closed flat shoes um so Let's see, we have some of my favorites in the back there. We have the huge Balenciagas. And then these are the newest addition to my closet. And I'm obsessed with these and I've been wearing them every chance that I get. And then back there we have, first of all, the most uncomfortable sneakers I've ever worn in my life. Um, these LV arch lights, terrible. And then all my Oxfords, because I'm an Oxford girl, and I just love Oxfords. So anyway, I honestly don't have like a concrete method that I follow every time I get dressed. Like I know some people always start with like shoes and then they'll style their whole look around shoes or an accessory. I pretty much just go on whatever my mood is that day and obviously the weather because i have to take that into consideration and then especially when i'm in boston i have to be mindful of the fact that i walk everywhere so comfort is key whereas when i'm back home i drive so i'm not really concerned about that so um today i feel like i'm just gonna style maybe three moods that i typically like to dress according to and then maybe I will do like a styling situation where it's around like a particular pair of shoes. So, like I know that I want to style a look around these guys just because I love them. And I just want to show you guys what it looks like when I wear them. These are the um, Undercover and Nike always forget what they're called which is crazy because i talk about them all the time but um i'll put the name of the actual sneaker in on screen so you guys can see it um and they're super comfortable i love them because i feel like as much as they're like a bright green i can wear them so many different ways uh which i have and i get more excited about a piece when there's like a lot of versatility to it and i can wear it many different ways um and they're bright green, you know? What more do I need to say? So we're definitely gonna start a look around these guys. And then um, let's pick pieces because there's a few things in here that I wanna show you. So starting back there, we're moving into fall now. So I'm really digging this leather blazer. It's like a beautiful brown shade. So let's pick that out. And then I always like to have a nice pair of trousers because they're just like, I like the fit of trousers. I like that 
they're not as restricting as denim sometimes you know denim doesn't really stretch so you cannot get as much movement out of denim so i always like to have a trouser i get a lot of questions about my trousers and honestly most of them are thrifted um if not thrifted they're purchased from the men's section because typically if i want the fit that i want i can either get it in a thrift store or i can only get it in the men's section i don't like the more fitted body hugging type of situation that they do for women so that's how i solve my problem so let's do a black trouser this is just a tapered situation from uniqlo i do believe did i get that from the men's section probably then we're gonna do why am i breathing so heavy am i tired um then let me do denim because i always need a denim option and i do wear denim quite a lot so should we do white denim or blue denim i feel like i do blue all the time but what could we style around white well we shall find out so let's take this white thigh from ray and then, uh, should we do one more? I'm feeling rather indecisive, which is typically how I tend to feel. And I am a Libra, so. Um, what do I want to wear? Should we just do a blue denim? I think we should. Should we do more fitted or more loose? Let's do a little more fitted but still loose. Okay. So that's three pairs of pants. Um, should we do three pairs of shoes too? Um, we might as well. Let's do some white Air Force classic. Then let's do should we do an Oxford? Yes. Let's do these guys from the Undercover and Doc Martin collab. Love. Now we need stuff we're gonna wear with these pants. Oh wait, we should do another jacket. Let's do a black blazer. Okay. I keep all the things that I want to fold so like underwear gym stuff t-shirts blah 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 so this is where all my t-shirts are as you can see I thought I was more organized but clearly I'm not and I can feel my mother judging me and I have way too many white t-shirts but what else? so let's do a white tank and a white t-shirt Oh, but look at this color so creamy so buttery okay we'll do this we'll do white we'll do a white tank top too yeah so honestly the thing with me oh this lighting so honestly I just really like the way I look right now with the Sun but also the truth is I really just wear basics. Um, I don't like play too much with prints. I don't play too much with color. I mostly just wear basics and then I'll alternate them and style them in different ways. Then I'll elevate them with particular pieces of outerwear or particular shoes. So yeah. So now we're gonna try on the looks and we're gonna talk about them. Okay, so let's talk about this a little bit. I am wearing this nude t-shirt that I thrifted. And then these pants, I believe, I got from Uniqlo while I was in Japan. Then I'm wearing my Doc Martens. This is a collab that they did with 
um, undercover lab. Then I just have my Louis Vuitton bag. I'm not sure what this is called, but I will try link it down below. So this outfit I'd probably wear if I was going to like lunch with a friend. Probably where we're going to be doing more sitting than walking because these shoes are actually terribly uncomfortable after too much walking. I've done a good job at like breaking them in, but they're definitely not as comfortable as like the original Doc Martin Oxford, so I probably wouldn't wear them. But this is just a very comfortable look. If I need to move around, I can. It's breathable. So if I am walking a lot, I won't get super hot and sweaty. But yeah, this is, this is pretty much one of my moods. Okay, so look to... jeez. Oh, Okay, so this look I would probably do if I'm running errands and I'm not going to be necessarily meeting anyone but I'm trying to look put together and I'm trying to look cool. So sometimes I have this thing where if I am going out alone and I'm not going to meet a friend and I'm just going to be running around town by myself, those are typically the days when I want to feel my most confident because, you know, I'm spending the whole day by myself. So I feel like when I wear something like a blazer, a pretty good large pair of sunglasses, I typically tend to feel that way and you know, I just feel, I feel super happy. So what I'm wearing here is this black blazer that I thrifted as well and then I have some denim jeans which I also thrifted. This is a really good pair of Lee's. I honestly find that for my body type, I don't like Levi's. I feel like Lee's fit me the best. And I like these because they're still pretty baggy and not too fitted, but they're fitted enough where it just doesn't look too baggy with the blazer. Cause sometimes I don't really feel like doing a fully oversized look. So I try to balance it out with something a little more fitted and that would be these jeans. Then this white crew neck, I also thrifted, but you can pretty much find white crew necks anywhere. Then of course I have my Nike sneakers, super comfortable. I can run around in these all day and I just love them. Then sometimes if I'm feeling, I feel like my looks typically lean more away from the feminine side so sometimes I like to add, you know, things that are more feminine, like for example, this really cute brown bag. I got this from Vert Girl. It's actually honestly not great quality. And I actually lost the zipper pretty early on. So I got this keychain and just added it in so that I could open the bag. Then I believe these sunglasses I got from Forever 21 years ago. Okay, so third and final look, I feel like I'm way too close, is probably my favorite. So this is definitely a look that I would wear probably on a night out, maybe on even a day out. I would really wear this mostly if I'm just trying to do something. Um, this look makes me feel really cool, super confident, and it's basically all styled around this brown blazer. So this is a blazer that I got from Express. They did this collection in collaboration with Negan, I believe, Marcelli, I'm not, 100% sure how to pronounce her last name, but it's just a really cool blazer. It fits well. It feels like really good quality. It is faux leather and I sized up because I wanted it to obviously be a lot more oversized and it's like nice and thick so I could tell that, you know, this would keep me pretty warm during the night. Um, on colder nights, I'd probably pair it with a turtleneck, but I'd still be pretty warm. I decided to bring it back the black trousers from the first look. I just felt like it would look 
um, cleaner and a little more elevated. And then I add a little bit of height with these black boots that I got from Tony Bianco. They're a really cool boot and the heel makes them really comfortable. They're not too high. And then I'm just wearing a white tank top that I got from Style Addict. Then I decided to add this pop of color uh, with this bright yellow bag that I got from W Concept. I thought it would just really make the look pop a little more. I would probably still carry this at night, but a black bag would pair really well with this as well. And then these sunglasses I got from Kith. They're just super cool. They're different. They're like a nice clear look. So I felt like they could really elevate the look. And they actually still really protect, this, um, protect your eyes from the sun, so. So that's it for this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you want me to film any more videos that are kind of like specific about this topic, um, definitely let me know in the comment section so that I can do that or just if you want to see others in general. But thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up so that I know and I'll see you guys in my next video.